much. Yeah, we've got some members of the riot student section with us <laughs> right now. But before we get to talking to them, we want to send things over to Frank DeLuca, who's going to talk about what this game means for William Blunt. Hey, Frank. Katie, heading into this game or this week, William Blunt did have an outside shot at making the playoffs, but unfortunately for the Governors, to keep those chances alive, they need a Westridge loss on Thursday night, and Westridge came away with the win. But wins and losses aside and playoff qualifications aside, William Blunt is 6-3 and three this season, which is a drastic turnaround from the state that they've been in the past two years. The only region team that they got a win against this year was Morristown East, which is the same team they needed to pull out a win last night. Jeff Coe has been impressive all season, so a win for the Governors would still mean a lot in terms of the overall success of this team. And closing out the year with a W against the Patriots would be one heck of a way to close out the schedule. Well, I think the, the most important thing for us is to beat a team like Jefferson County, who's a traditionally you know, great football program, uh, great coaches. Spencer does a great job. Uh, our guys know that it's going to be a tough battle because they are really a good team this year. Uh, but at times we've shown the ability to be a really good team ourselves. Now last year, William Blunt only had 45 varsity football players on the team, which for a 6A squad is not that great of a numbers, but closing out this year, 7-3 and three, would do a lot in the overall growth of this program. Back to you.